Day two, we ready to go here. Today's gonna be all experiments, all just hardcore science. It's eight in the morning. Uh, we're gonna go get breakfast, and then we have to meet up with our lab groups and then start doing some of these experiments. And the cool part is, like, there's four rotations. So the first rotation will start on today, and then we'll do a second rotation on Tuesday and we'll rotate. And as groups change from one rotation to the next, they build on each other's experiments. And it's not even like the experiments are already um, established. They're actually very, very, very open and we actually don't know some of the answers yet so pretty much on the edge research so learning the theory everything and then like we're going to do all of the stuff today and then present it tomorrow and so the next group that does our rotation knows what to build on and then we are going to join someone else's rotation so we need to know what to build on so basically it's like it's stuff like that but that's the sciencey part uh, this one we're going to make some eggs <laughs> and muffins and that i already put it away but i've been i've been cleaning everything i actually been finishing all my food i'm actually really proud of that I did not leave any waste, leave no trace. So I'm gonna find some orange juice now. No, just a lot of milk. There are waffles. I'm surprised you didn't see anyone discovering waffles. Also, yeah, like there was just one cream cheese, like even last night when it came, and there's still only one this morning. Like no one went for the last cream cheese. We just finished breakfast. Oh man. Problem is that there was no coffee. If I eat a lot, parasympathetic system overdrive is like what I like to call <laughs> what ends up happening which is just massive relax rest and digest start the day off with some theory behind what we're doing probably and then actual experiments until 11 p.m. is what I've heard ooh look at the the view hashtag views hashtag views and each strip is going to represent a particular tubule okay mm -hmm. And the way you're going to do it is you're going to put all the strips in your block. <laughs> no, but we actually have a project. We're going to be doing things. Um, we're doing a QPCR. Or we're reverse transcribing first. This is just a massive throwback to all of undergrad. I think it's so great. 18 feet. What? Oh. This is so pretty. And what do you think of this? What do I think? Yeah. This is beautiful. That's what I said. Ah. <laughs> Great minds think alike. All labs. So every lab was set up that way, and there were tanks, water tanks. And it was pumping fresh salt water from there through all these tanks and then back into this side. Mm -hmm. So they would suck it out over here, run it through all these. So that building right there, that thing that's open right there, and that there's another one up there, we're huge tanks full of sharks and skates and oh, all kinds. Yeah. You can walk out here and so every morning I would come out here and get mussels. There's all the See all this seaweed? Yes. So high tide would be up about where that black line is mm -hmm. on the rocks across there and at low tide you can walk through here. It's, it's 18 feet so this thing's on hinges. I think it's rising now because it was lower this morning. It's scaring me. This is Frenchman's Bay. That's that's the coast of Maine. That's actual coast of Maine right there. This is the island. This is the island here. And it's like it's kind of like Long Island Sound in a way that it, I mean it's closer, but it's exactly it's perfect sailing. You got wind, but you don't get the big waves. So you can look out there. I mean you can see the the, the ruffling tells you there's a lot of wind out there, but there's no big waves. And it's, it's, it's a perfect place to learn to sail. So we would bring our lunch, bring a little bag lunch. Mm. These little guys were here. You would row out to your mooring, hook the boat to the mooring, disconnect the sailboat, put the sail up. Are we gonna jump? Is that what you need to do? Yeah. If I do it with this phone in my hand, that's a bad idea, right? That's a very bad idea. Wow, Aaron was a superstar. He just did. Go, Isaac. It's gonna be caught on camera regardless. Oh, success. Yeah. Success. Will I do it? I don't know if I'm down. I made it. I'm alive. Um, it was scarier than I thought it would be. Research. All right, let's let's go out on the tip here. Look at this, everyone. I'm on the tip of this rock. It's a rock point vlog thing. <laughs> What's up? We're just oh, yeah. out here on a tip. It's beautiful. I wish I could show the other parts. Here, I will. We're on like this tip. Oh wow! What is this? 
think it's a rap bar. It's a rap bar? That's some next level stuff right here. I don't even know how to describe this. It's like pasta salad with lettuce, cheese. There's like an egg right here. So just like an amalgam of things. Right, what did you think of these cookies? I think they're very solid and I eat them. And by solid, he means chewy. It means I probably have had like four or five already and probably could eat another four. Exactly. <laughs> Albert, what do you think about these cookies? Delicious. Oh my goodness. We're going to sell. <laughs> no, we're vlogging. <laughs> you can be in the vlog too. He's not interested right now. <laughs> How's the bodybuilding, dude? It's going, man. Dude, it's someone like... didn't believe you bench 420. I'll have to make a proof video. Proof yeah. it wrong. <laughs> you got it. I'm you standing gotta... in the in face of so many home-baked cookies, and I'm just... That's true. I haven't even touched one. The mental... The mental stamina of mental this man. Mental fortitude. Mental fortitude to just... <laughs> look at this. Look at him. Look at this. <laughs> no. Hold him back. Hold him back. Hold him back. Hold <laughs> Yakov, day two. What are you day thinking? two. What are this you is an incredible experience. State of the art laboratories. We gotta show you around. It's really beautiful in there, and the views outstanding. Yeah, we like put in a cube. What are you doing? What? Oh, it's nap time. <laughs> we have. They gave us thirty minutes nap time. Wait, dude, are we off right now? I don't know what we're doing right now. Okay, I guess we're not doing anything. So you guys already know Fuad. Yeah, Actually, yeah. I don't think I've officially introduced you. This is well, they know June and Yakov. This is Jonathan. <laughs> He's my cute PCR buddy. Wait, what were you saying? Oh, that's it. It's just this is nap time at Yale Medical School. <laughs> Actually, no. June was saying something of like she if she worked here, she just would not get work done because we did it. We put in like a breath, reverse transcript days PCR, and then we were like, let's go to the beach, and then we just went down the stairs, and it was right there. Do you see it? Like. But then Lori told us about how they used to cut sharks. Yeah. What time is it? Five. 5.32. We've been in this room for like the last four hours just analyzing data. <laughs> analyzing qPCR data. Let me tell you something about qPCR data. You never want to analyze qPCR data. <laughs> Especially just like one day activity. Especially when it's pretty outside. Oh look, yeah, it's like so nice outside too. <laughs> we had to pull this thing down to make sure we couldn't see how nice it was, or else we were gonna be morally destroyed. It's literally like the prettiest place. Ever. <laughs> this is our statistician number one. Hi. How was how was the analyst? It's going. It's going hard. Yeah. This I'll is go uh, June. She's the brains behind the operation here. <laughs> That's a lie. She's uh, working hard with our presentation. The artist. <laughs> She's the only one working right now. And then this is Jonathan. He's uh, another data analyst. How is the data analyzing? It's, it's data. <laughs> <laughs> I think the general conclusion we came to was like, nothing makes sense. Like, n everything we expected to happen... Didn't happen. Did not happen, yeah. And so now we have to change all of our hypotheses. The basically, the general project was like, acute kidney injury is bad. How can we make it better? And then our results were, we can't. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm not sure that was the like, result of this. <laughs> well, June is, an, June is optimistic. She keeps our morale up. I had spaghetti and uh, red sauce today for dinner. We're still gonna go back in there. There's a lot to analyze, to be honest. There's just so much data. Why is that so annoying? Um, but we'll get through it. It'll be fun. And I'm still surprised I know as much as about research as I did when I was an undergrad, because we're doing some high-level stuff. I did not think we'd be going this high. We're like QPCR data. Um, doing pretty intense stuff, and it was, it's been only like 10 hours. And now, uh, because we're done with little dinner, I have about half an hour before we're supposed to head back, so I'm gonna play some basketball with a soccer ball. Three, two, what? What's up guys? So the day is officially over. I'm actually gonna take a seat because I'm tired. It's been a long day. It's actually, I'd say 10.30. We started at 8 a.m. in the morning. It's 10.30 now. Um, it's a very long day. We did a bunch of qPCR analysis, gene analysis, stuff that you would not expect to do in one day, but we did all of it. We made a presentation. It's amazing. It is amazing. And we found things that have never been found before. And that's not that's not like a huge deal because like when you do something this specific, it, you will find results that are very surprising. We found a lot of results that were surprising. But more important than that, you actually just get to 
um, do a lot of like, I wonder why I'm seeing the results I'm seeing, which is the hallmark of medicine and science in general, and that was really fun. So, so that's today, and um, ultimately just really happy. We had a great mentor, Lloyd. Shout out to Lloyd Cantley. Um, and so yeah, that's the end of the day today. So from that, hope you guys enjoyed watching this. I think tomorrow is a lot more of a fun day. We'll be doing a lot of other things. There's thunderstorms prepped. I'm so excited for thunderstorms if they happen. If not, totally fine. Still gonna have a great time. So like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.